Hey everybody, JRSPC here with another box break video, and today we're checking out the 2021 Topps Gallery Baseball. Uh, I know this has been out for a good month, uh, I just haven't opened any of it yet, so uh, four exclusive printer-proof parallels. I don't know what the heck printer-proofs are, I guess it's because uh, they have more um, non-art cards in here than they have artist proofs. So anyways, there's the, the odds on the packs for the blaster boxes. I'm going to go ahead and take a pause there. Um, super tough to pull a uh, autograph out of these uh, these blasters. You do get two autographs in every mega box, so that's really cool. But they're 80 bucks. <laughs> uh, but, you know, you get what you pay for. You're going to get two autographs. Well, I shouldn't say you get what you pay for because uh, I don't feel like you get $80 worth of autographs. <laughs> but... So, uh, I, watching a lot of people's videos of these right here, I noticed that they're kind of confused. Like, um, Jab's family, Eric Jab's, uh, even his last video, looking at them, he's like, Yeah, these are so great. Can you believe that these are drawn? And they are not drawn. There's only certain ones that are drawn. If, it, if, if the back of it says, um, has an artist's name, then you know it's an art card. Uh, but, or then you know it, it's, a, it's, an, it's an artist's uh, card, but... Anyways, most of these are not done. I'm not sure why Tops may have had a problem uh, commissioning enough artists or something. Who knows? Right there on the back, number one PC card. Alrighty. Let's take a look. Yeah, see, now this is a nice uh, Reggie Jackson. This is, not, um, this is not a painting. This is a regular picture, obviously. Uh, it would say uh, artist back here if it was done by an artist. Really nice, though. Mookie Betts. That's a good-looking card. Anthony Rizzo, that's going to be your printer proof. <laughs> um, that stuff does increase the value on certain things, like my 2018 ones, I opened up a whole bunch, and like my PSA 10s of Juan Soto rookies and stuff like that, they were um, quite a bit more money than the base ones, but I don't think it increases the value too much on just a base card. So, hey, Juan Soto, speaking of the man. All right, Bob Gibson. Oh, that was a really nice rainbow foil, Fernando Tatis. Super cool card. I just put down right there. There we go. Will Clark, printer proof. Good signing through the mail. That would look great with an autograph. Mr. Clark, that may be coming to you. Juan Soto, the future of baseball. Probably going to take over the number one player spot when Mike Trout retires. Not that anyone's looking forward to that because we love Trout. In fact, man, we miss watching him play. Nelson Cruz. He was out most of the year with injuries. Hey, Alec, Alec Baum. Uh, or Alec Baum. <laughs> God, I can't even speak today. Alec Baum. Rookie card. That's going to be next wave. Kind of reminds me of the old Wave of the Futures by Flair. Uh, Akil Badu rookie card. Per did a pretty good job last year and recently retired. Buster Posey. Got those stained glasses in here, I think. Those are some pretty darn nice looking cards. Bobby Dahlbeck rookie. Ernie Banks, printer proof, the greatest, one of the greatest shortstops of all time anyways, all around. And another Will Smith, or Will Smith, Will Clark, told you, you can't talk today, Corbin Burns. <laughs> Is that doubles with that Will Clark? Was one of them one of those proof, yeah, one of them was one of those proof cards. Printer proofs. Next up, we got Donnie Baseball on the back, Aaron Nolan on the front. I just said Nolan. Golly, Aaron Nola. Daniel Lynch. And another nice rainbow foil of Brandon Lau. And Donnie Baseball. There you go. See? No artist name. Now, hopefully we'll find a card where I can show you the artist's name. I think those original cards or whatever they, they are, the one subset, I think those might be art cards. That's a nice Paul Goldschmidt. Davey Garcia. Corbin Burns printer proof and Salvador Perez quickly yes, quickly slowly well quickly being recognized as one of the best catchers of all time you know after after a fairly long career Steven Strasburg hey here's one of those cards but that is also not an art card MLB originals interesting design here I got it set up so it looks like a card it's all beat up. Interesting. And Vladdy Jr. And the last card is going to be an Alex Bregman. All right. Nothing super overwhelming. In fact, these are pretty underwhelming as far as I'm concerned. But 
that is what it is. You guys have a great rest of the day. I did get a couple good PC cards in there, mainly the Trout, and I do like the Tatish too. So, very cool. And, you know, I Soto, PC Soto too, so not a lot of cards for 20 bucks, but what are you going to do? <laughs> you guys have a great rest of the day, and we'll see you all soon. Later.